welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to see you here and today I have another exciting vlog for you. I love doing vlogs because it's a great memory for me. I love looking back at the times but I also love watching vlogs so I hope you do as well. But as you can see from the title I'm actually flying to Finland and then Estonia to be with my mom for her birthday and in total I'm gonna be there for five days. But uh, yeah let me show you quickly maybe my outfit, what I packed and uh, then Let's go on the journey. I'm excited. So for the airport, I always like to wear something super comfortable. And I have these actually leggings and some white sneakers because white sneakers always fit and I love to travel with them. And on top, I decided to go with this top. I don't have any jewelry. I keep my makeup very minimal. And uh, here is the suitcase that I'm gonna take. I'm traveling just with a carry-on and I have my backpack. Of course, I have a hoodie with me because I I'm gonna need it on the flight, I'm always freezing on my flights and I still haven't decided on the coat because in Finland I think it is about still around zero degrees at least for the first few day days or first few nights actually during the day it's better but the nights are still quite cold but yeah then I'm gonna rush to the airport um, hopefully I don't have to update you hopefully there is no you know things with the uh, S-Bahn so yeah the next time you're gonna see me I'll be at the airport to the airport and I'm a bit disappointed because normally in Munich Terminal 2 there's a lot of nice shops and I came earlier so I could walk around because I'm gonna be sitting for a while and I was also quite inactive today at home. I didn't check and turns out that I'm flying from Terminal 1 and I got into like a section when there's only young drunk guys going to Mallorca so <laughs> definitely not my vibe and they only have like one mini duty-free shop so I already scoured that like three times and now yeah now I'm just sitting again and I'm watching some series and I bought some chips because I was like feeling like I wanted to have that yeah I think I will update you tomorrow because like I said today I'm just gonna get to the apartment and sleep rest and uh, yeah tomorrow's gonna be a new day past three and I spent the morning by myself I actually slept really 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 well I had no distractions no pets no boyfriends no alarms it's been really a very peaceful night of sleep that doesn't happen that often anymore so I'm super super happy about that and then I actually went to eat uh, lunch a friend of my brother owns a restaurant and uh, he invited me to come over and actually my plan for today was to be kind of my introverted self to enjoy because my I didn't mention it I think that my mom actually comes only tomorrow my brother being my brother he kind of told everyone that knows me out of his friends that I'm in Finland alone and now I'm getting invitations to go everywhere but uh, yeah I actually have quite a lot of homework to do so I thought I would be doing that but now I still have to text some people and see what I'm gonna do. But after lunch I walked a little bit in the mall where the restaurant was. I got this scarf because I actually got some throat pain lately. And now I'm just walking home. It's around 40 minute walk. I thought I would enjoy that, get some steps in since I'm not working out. But uh, yeah, I guess I'm gonna give you a small update of what I end up doing, who I end up going with. All the offers are very tempting.
just got home. I don't know, I think I'm actually planning to cancel all the plans because I'm not feeling super great. Like I said, I got some throat pain yesterday evening and now after the walk the wind was super strong and I'm getting like a slight headache. I'm feeling super tired, although, you know, I just had the walk. I quickly stopped the, the shop and I bought some vitamin C. I got some grapes to snack on and as well some strawberries, so I just want to stock up on some vitamins i really don't want to be sick because my mom is coming tomorrow not so exciting because i'm actually skipping a few cool plans uh, a friend of ours invited me to go on a boat ride and the other one invited me to like a terrace opening so yeah i think there will be no more major updates today i'll see you guys tomorrow hopefully with the good news that i'm feeling better now Sunday it is the next day and uh, actually it's already 5 p.m. I've been really busy today so I thought I'm gonna give you an update it was nothing vlog worthy but still I woke up and I went to have uh, some breakfast somewhere and again I took it really really easy in the morning I like to chill out I don't really have any responsibilities so that's nice and then I had to go first to one side of the city to pick up a key and then go back to the other side of the city all with the public transport and uh, the reason was because I'm helping my nephew to move out of his student dormitory and since he already left someone needed to you know pack up all the stuff clean up the room etc and <laughs> the honor fell onto me sadly but of course I cannot say no so I did that and it took me around three or four hours which was uh, you know not the most pleasant thing in this sun I would rather do so many other things but, you know, things you do for your family. But yeah, something that I wanted to talk about is the public transport. As some of you may or may not know, I am a vivid Munich transport hater. And uh, it's a great contrast to see, you know, something in another country that works so perfectly. And it's just striking that every single transport is on time, but like by the minute. And now I actually bought a yeah, day ticket because I'm gonna pick up my mom later and so on. But yeah, I think after this massive cleanup, I'm gonna just take it easy, maybe stay somewhere outside on the sun. And uh, in a few hours, I'm gonna go and pick up my mom. So let's see how her flight went, how she feels. And uh, yeah, I'm excited to not finally spend most of my days alone, although it has been nice. I've been enjoying some me time. What just happened? <laughs> so, lucky woman. <laughs> lucky us. So, there's two options to go from the airport to the city. Either by bus or by train. And on Friday the bus was so quick and good. So I said, let's just take the bus. The station is closer. And we drove for around 10 minutes. And someone threw a stone from a hill at the bus and the glass broke. And now they took, kicked us out and we are standing middle of nowhere waiting for the next bus, which will probably be super full. So, you know, just usual things. <laughs> me, in, go back to me saying how good public transport is in Finland. <laughs> I think public transport doesn't like me in any country. No, it's good. But it's good, but people the people are around. bad. <laughs> oh, the bus is coming. So it is the next day. Yesterday we didn't do much except of our bus adventure. We got home and uh, kind of packed our stuff, unpacked our stuff, relaxed. Flights are always <laughs> flights are always stressful. But today is the next day. As you can see, it's a beautiful sunny morning. It's actually warmer than it has been the other days. And we are on the ship on our way to Tallinn. As some of you may or may not know, my dad used to be a first officer on the ships. Different kinds, starting from cargo. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> starting from cargo ships to passenger ships. So I have been also as well on countless ones since I've been a kid. But now we're gonna enjoy our trip. It's about two, two and a half hours long. We 
have just arrived to the hotel. We had to spend a few hours outside. Yeah, we just got something to quickly to eat and uh, we walked around a little bit, but now we could check in. So let me show you our room. It's not super big, but it's good in the city center. It's four stars. So as you can come in, we have here a little hallway, shower, toilet, pretty standard. And as you go into the other room, we have our two beds, a little closet, a chill area, a table area full of our stuff already. And as always a mirror. But yeah, now we're actually gonna enjoy a little bit of time here. And my mom has a hair styling appointment soon. So we're gonna go there and I will show you the before and after. So this is our hair before. Do you think somebody's interested? <laughs> and after. Do you like it? <laughs> Come on. It looks good. <laughs> so it is now almost 9 p.m. What did we do after your haircut? We <laughs> went to Biro. to the shopping center, we walked around a little bit and uh, actually we went to our common family friends, had dinner with them and uh, talked and yeah, kind of spent the, na the evening just meeting people and doing things <laughs> that you normally do. And now we are both so, so done <laughs> and we don't know what other plans we want to do tomorrow. We didn't plan anything. We said we will see how we will feel and uh, decide then. The only plan for tomorrow is to sleep without an alarm clock <laughs> and a birthday party, but that's only at four. So good night and see you tomorrow. It is the next day and we are actually quite bad vloggers because we didn't really talk or show you much yesterday but we were enjoying the moment. It was my mom's birthday as I already told you. And uh, first we went to the cinema and then we walked around shopped a little bit. I actually found some really nice dresses for me that I have been looking for an upcoming wedding. And then we went to the restaurant where we met with friends and family and we had a really good time so that's why we didn't film and i think it's important to you know also be in the moment but how did you like your day you're all you you and dad are so <laughs> talkative on my videos i have to push out every single word out yeah and today it's our last day actually we're just about to check out we packed our bags and uh, we are gonna go our separate ways i'm gonna go to the airport fly back to Munich and my mom's gonna go on the train and continue her journey ahead. So it's been a good time, short, but Very good, yes. but good and we're gonna see each other soon, <coughs> hopefully. We have not planned any trips yet, but we will see. So do you have any last words? Yeah, <laughs> for, the vi for the video. <laughs> yes, I want to thank so children for this great travel thank you all right and i will see you then again next week thank you for watching bye, bye.